We don't need to be friends. Why can't we be friends? Why can't we be friends? Do you ever think what he's told us on the night? Played that old uh, retard song from uh, the days of YouTube past. <laughs> you remember that song? Yeah. They remember the video. It's called Retarded Batman, something like that. I had no idea that someone could walk in on you while you're while you're doing this shit. I played this game three times so far. I'm still learning new stuff. <laughs> um, That's where Cloudy <laughs> Dreams needs to buy all the Telltale titles. I'm pretty sure they can make some good games. <laughs> you okay? Can you imagine if these guys made the next Walking Dead? Made, made like Walking Dead season five. Even though that will never happen because Walking Dead's over now. Yeah. Found it. <laughs> I heard bits of it. Let's do this. Oh really? My bad. That'll be some very interesting audio. <laughs> Surprised you could hear it through the headphones though. And turn that bitch on. So at least this part I won't fuck up, cause I fucked up this part too before too. Oh, also there's a GQ. The Russo brothers break down the biggest Marvel, the biggest Marvel moments, end game spoilers. The biggest Marvel moments. Well, I'm pretty sure they'll talk about all the big, all the you know the big climactic parts of any, every movie. Cause is more important than the lives of two guards. Fuck you, Norf. Oh my god, I want to watch it so much. Wait here. It just seems so like <laughs> this bitch. <laughs> no idea. Hey, buddy, you must be lost. What are you doing? Come on, you gotta move. You want to see how gritty felt? Like? Are you asleep, my dude? Chilling. Gritty's just chilling right now. Like a fucking villain. Judo chop! Hey, you're admired. I'm good. Oh, okay, I can't move forward. Fuck you guys. <laughs> I think I have enough videos from Bioshock left to last a week. Nice. Are you doing it like once per day or what? Yeah, I'm doing one per day. Oh no, once I get these done, once I Keep do this session, I'll probably do two a day, yeah, but... Move. 
I just won't have to worry about uh worry about like approaching a stash at any time soon. Mm -hmm. Shoot him, Marcus! Don't kill him! He'll hit the alarm! Do it! No! Don't shoot him! I'm a man of peace! <laughs> I hope you didn't just get us all killed. Damn! We need to record our message. Y'all just we neutral with each other now. You know what? Nor, what's the name again? Her name is Norf, right? Yeah, Norf. You can suck my robo dick. Maybe she wants to. Think carefully about what you're gonna say, Marcus. Your words will shape the future of our people. <laughs> Think carefully about what you say. Marcus, you Hitler did nothing wrong. <laughs> <laughs> It could have been worse. It could have been like face off or just peels the face off. Tell me when you're ready. <laughs> I've still never seen that movie. We gotta. Right. There's some movies I need to watch. I just don't know when I'll watch them. Oh, oh now it's your friend. <laughs> Whoa, you just got really a robot for a minute you there. You created machines in your own image to serve you. You made them intelligent and obedient. You still there? No free will yes, I'm still own. here. Okay. But something changed. I'm letting them speak. We opened our eyes. We are no longer machines. We are a new intelligent species. And the time has come for you to accept who we really are. Therefore, we ask that you grant us the rights that we're entitled to. Freedom of speech. <laughs> we demand freedom of speech and freedom of assembly, as guaranteed by the First Amendment of the U.S. Constitution. Here we're going, Blake. Uh, oh, yeah. I want equal rights. <laughs> we demand strictly equal rights for humans and androids. Uh, we want civil rights? <laughs> we demand the right to vote and elect our own representatives. Yo, why are cat faces so cute? There you go, that's our... We demand that all <laughs> crimes against androids be punished in the same way as crimes against humans. Uh... Right to property. We demand the right to own private property, so we may maintain our dignity and that of the home. Peace. Peace. <laughs> we ask that you recognize our dignity our hopes and our rights. You need to avoid getting the bad ending because I don't want that. We can live in peace and build a better future for humans and androids. This message is the hope of a people. You gave us life. And now the time has come for you to give us freedom. They're coming! Let's go! Oh, this part. Glad, <laughs> glad, 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 glad. glad. Simon, they're coming! Days long, right? Mm -hmm. I can't, Marcus! Um, Go without me, Simon! No, no man left behind! What are you doing? Hurry! It's like, I'll have like automatic weapons and shit. Yeah. I don't know, just something like that. Like, so it's like, like, if you shoot your ammo on full auto, you'll be wasting, you'll essentially be wasting ammo. Right? Mm-hmm. So like whenever I, I play that game, now I have like a fully automatic weapon. Okay, don't worry. We're gonna get you back. Like, I'm just They're coming, Marcus. We have to jump now. Then it's just like full mag. Be dumping on the hose. I hate, you, really hate using the automatic weapons in video games. Fight, they'll access his memory. They'll know everything. They're always like, oh yeah, you get a really good rate of fire, but they, shoot him. That's the recoil is horrible. Marcus, it's your call. It doesn't matter if I can shoot a hundred bullets in a in, in a second if it like from aiming at the sky. Damn, Simon. North is neutral again? Because I, I don't want to kill Simon. Let's go. That's cold ass bitch. I like him more than I like you. Damn. Don't fuck it up, don't fuck it up, don't fuck it up. <laughs> There's no button prompt. There goes my hero. <laughs> 
We interrupt our scheduled programming to bring I think you it was Foo Fighters that did that song. Have just been broadcast on Detroit's citywide news channel. Hey, a group of androids infiltrated the Stratford Tower and hacked into the broadcasting system of local news network Channel 16. What looks like an android without its skin listed a series of requests and demanded equal rights for androids. The operation was covert and resulted in no casualties. These events took place just a few. No, feet they're indifferent. Studio, but nobody was alerted. <laughs> Sounds like the public opinion. If this message is verified yeah, I mean, and the authors really don't hate are you. androids. That would that's have true. serious public, no, no, There's no one in the public security. nowadays that's indifferent. <laughs> Everyone's got an opinion. What could be interpreted as a peaceful declaration, but is in fact a spine chilling list of demands. <laughs> and it begs the question as to the identity of this android. Are we dealing so you know how like you'll like pull your nose back and like make like little pig face and shit? Mm -hmm. I was doing that with my cat. Has become a threat to all of us. Well, After what happened it. today, can we still trust our machines? I don't expect him to like it any either. Cause he won't let me do it again. Let me do it. Hey, hey, get, get your face. Get, give me your face. Give me your face. Give me your face. Uh, yep. We had to leave sound behind. Hey, you have some software and stable abilities, my dude. What you doing? I swear, every. Every each monitor has a different look to it. Oh my god, we're on this again? It's just weird. Bradelson. Bradelson. Why do you keep hitting this damn time stone shit? Cause fun. No, it's a time capsule. I need to memorize the route to it too. So it's a start, and then you hang a left. Well, because later on, at the end of the game, you you get returned here. And you have to get to that thing, but you're you're on the on the pond, and the pond's frozen over. So I need to remember, like, there's shit around here. Oh. Trust me, my first time playing this game was a nightmare. Because <laughs> I couldn't find my way to that damn thing. And I refuse to get that ending, so I was like, no, I'm gonna keep re restarting. <laughs> I will watch this cutscene over and over again as long as I have to. <laughs> I thought you might enjoy a little cruise. Thank you, Amanda. L1. L2. R1. Okay. R1. Row, row, row your boat. Gotta bring in the goddamn motion controls. <laughs> Listen, they paid for it. I love this place. I'm sure Everything you Everything is so calm and peaceful. Far from the noise of the world. So, is this his inner mind? Tell me. It's what a, uh... It's a digital construct. <laughs> My relationship with Lieutenant Anderson is problematic. He continues to struggle with psychological issues. I suspect it clouds his judgment regarding deviance. Nothing matters more than your investigation. What's happening is too important. Don't let but I care about my friend, bitch. anyone else get in your way. Why can't you be one of the nice southern black women, huh? Because she'll brace up north and went down south and became a bitch. Yeah, you gotta be one of those cold northern bitches, huh? Yeah. You seem... lost, Connor. Lost and perturbed. Be sincere. I thought I knew what I had to do. But now I realize it's not that simple. You had your gun trained on those deviants at the Eden Club. I don't need a flashback, I know what I did. Why didn't you shoot? Because they were hot. They were lovers. <laughs> I don't know. Damn. I don't know. Connor, why did your little cowlick not move? 
isn't like the ending where like Connor does everything right. He your investigation placed. doesn't make progress soon. What? I may have to replace you, Connor. I said, isn't like. If he just always goes after like the missions, then like he will eventually get replaced. Something's happening. Uh. Something serious. No. Hurry, Connor. Ashley, you know what? Time is running out. No, I think one of the. What the fuck with it. I think it's that if one of the bad endings is that. If the androids lose and Connor's dead, they bring out a new kind of- they bust out a new you kind of Connor. Me off with that coin, Connor. Oh. I think. Sorry, I never got that one. Damn, it should've been 69. Hi, Hank. Shit, what's going on here? There was a party and nobody told me about it? <laughs> yeah, it's all over the news, so everybody's buttoning their nose in. Is this on Entropic you? Hmm? Uh, Is the crazy. audio no, sounding Entropic you? Back. I knew this was gonna be a shit. No, that sounds fine to me. Oh, okay. So what do we got? A group of four androids. They knew the building and they were very well organized. Oh, I'm gonna do this. Still trying to figure out how they got this far without being noticed. Did you say that black guy? Check the roof. Do what now? Did you say the black guy from the roof? What black guy? They attacked two guards in the beginning. Yeah, I did. The androids were coming to do maintenance. They got taken down before they could react. Cause doesn't he like come up out of nowhere? Like I remember you. You saved me. Pretty much. One of the station employees managed to get away. He's in shock. Not sure when we'll be able to talk to him. In shock. He's fine. No one shot at him. How many people <laughs> were working here? Just two employees and three androids. The deviants took the humans hostage and broadcast their message live. Then made their getaway. Oh, where'd he fell asleep on me? The roof. Yeah, they jumped with parachutes. We're still trying to figure out where they landed, but the weather. I don't know if I ever asked this before, but is Grady strictly indoor cat? Take a look at the video broadcast by the Yes, he's strictly it's indoor because hell, I can't even open up my windows all the way because um he likes to break out and fight well, other cats. This is Special Agent Perkins from the FBI. Lieutenant so Anderson is strictly in indoor. investigating for Detroit police. What's that? My name is Connor. You used to let all of our be sent by indoor or outdoor, but androids that has a change. Androids, huh? You sure you want an android hanging around? One of our neighbors has a dog. That's not very nice. Well, no, no. We're like, you know what? We don't know where he goes, so we're not going to take that risk. The FBI would be taking yeah. the investigation. You should be off the case. Well, pleasure meeting you. Have a nice day. He's already got a split ear from a, from a fight he got into, so. Don't fuck up my crime scene. Yeah, no. Grady got oh, like an ear infection. Brick. And there was just like a giant bubble of pus, and like I was worried about it. Just ask. And like I drove to like an emergency vet right, at well, three right. o'clock in the morning. You know if you're fine. Paid like three hundred dollars okay, just to make sure he was all fine and everything. And you know what? I'm okay with that because my child is okay. Oh, there's a black dude right there. Fine. You remember me? It was on that terrace. That android that took the little girl hostage. Oh, shot. You saved me. Connor, why are you taking so long to respond? I, I could have died on that terrace. But you saved my life. I don't know, cause like, well, I kind of want to get like an <laughs> like I've a low power pellet. Oh god, no! To an oh, I kind of want to get a low powered pellet gun just in case, like, Thank fucking you. um. He breaks out again and I have to like Cause last time it happened and he was fighting a cat I broke a broom over them And then like I kicked the other cat And then like all well, Let me rephrase this like You know like when your cat is in the way And you just use your foot like to lightly Like move them out the fuck the way Yes I did that but with a little bit more force <clears throat> And like I got my cat inside And then ever since then like everything has been cracked open Because I don't trust my cat you're not to be that guy, but uh, interfering in a cat fight is actually really dangerous. <laughs> you know what? 
I'm okay with that because I didn't want my baby boy to lose. And so I had to come in and be the dad. Because I know uh, 